All right, guys, we're going to keep this short and sweet today, but I'm giving you a lot of information in this little short video. Today, I'm going to be making a rice water. As you know, I have started the journey to see how this rice water will benefit my natural hair. I was going to do skin and hair, but I decided that I'm going to stick with the hair for now, and we're going to do 60 days. But I wanted to get this out there to you guys because you guys might want to start with me because I'm on week two so far, and I will be updating you on how this works for me. But today, I'm going to share with you how I create this. This is all I use to create mine. I have a colander. I have a glass spaghetti jar that I am reusing because glass is better than plastic. Plastic releases a lot of toxins that are not good for your hair or your face. So that's why I would recommend a glass jar. I have a funnel and I also have a bowl and I have a quarter cup of Dollar Tree rice. That is all your girl's going to be using today. But let me tell you a little bit more about where this derives from and why everybody is so in a craze about trying this on their natural hair and skin. So just gonna give you a little bit about them. These are the Yao women and they derive from Southeast Asia, Japan, and China. So here they are and look how gorgeous their hair is. The lady on the right looks like she has some age on her but you do not see a strand of gray hair, okay? So all these are women that are of age and women who are very young. They only get one haircut during their life and they do the rice water washing weekly. This is something that they do to strengthen their hair, keep their hair strong, and keep their hair from turning gray. This has been around for many, many centuries, and this has got people in America that are natural and not natural crazed about wondering what are the benefits of this rice water and why not try it here. So today I'm just gonna be showing you how I'm making this rice water. I'm gonna do another in-depth video of how this is beneficial to your hair. Now here we have me just rinsing off the rice water just to get any impurifications that were in the bag or any particles that might have been floating around in the bag off of the rice. Make sure it's cool water. Now we're gonna go into taking the filtered water and rinsing this rice out of this colander. You guys know that once rice get a little wet, it gets sticky and we don't want it sticking into the colander because we need it all so that we can ferment it and put it on our hair. So now after I take that rice out of the colander, I'm gonna get into that glass jar using my funnel because the funnel is going to ensure that I get all the goodness back into the glass jar guys this is very simple it's not difficult you can use the rice of your choice if you want to go organic you can if you want to go with wild rice you can if you want to use the rice that I have which is a dollar tree rice you can as well I have been doing this for a couple weeks and I'm going to be doing it for about 60 days I think that's a great time to see how this really works for me and come back and give you guys updates in between and let you know how it's been going I wanted to do some skin and hair but I think I'm gonna stick with just the hair because guys just the FYI this stuff has a odor to it okay now you can let this stuff sit in the water for 15 to 30 minutes and you can use it right away but the longer you allow it to sit in the water and ferment it has more potency and it's more beneficial to your hair but it's up to you now if you have a problem with protein you may want to dilute this instead of taking that water straight out of the glass and pouring it into your hair and washing it you may want to dilute it before you do that so that way it's not as potent and it will not make your hair brittle because this is sort of like a natural protein treatment so i want to put that out there but guys this is done now i'm going to let it sit for 24 hours and then after the 24 hours i will be removing the rice and utilizing the actual fermented rice water on my hair guys if you enjoyed this video if you have any questions make sure you leave them below and also thumbs up this video and share it with someone else that this can be beneficial to guys stay tuned for my journey and guess what i will see you guys in the next video later gators